Hey, family and friends, how are you out there? I'm super duper amazing. I hope you are as well. Today, I'm going to be making homemade cheeses. You heard it, homemade cheeses. Every time my birds are out in the living room, they want to say hello to you guys as well. So, say hi to Mango and Rio. Quiet now, quiet down. Anyways, uh, this is just cheddar cheese. And I've got them in uh, like squares here. I, I'm uh, ball them like that, okay? And try to get them as thin as possible. I'm gonna double them and then cut them right down the middle. Okay, I haven't done this before, so if I mess up, I'll, you know, we'll do it together, okay? There we go, perfect. And then we're gonna lay them on a line cookie sheet. Okay. And if they're not all the same size, don't worry about it, guys. Don't stress out over it. I'm not going to. I got this recipe off the internet. This is not from you know a random individual that I know or anything. Well, random, of course, is someone I don't know, but an individual that I know. So I found this off. I don't know what kind of cooking channel it was. But I think I want to try this. Because we're big cheeses people in my family. Uh, we all like them. And my uh, birds, they love cheeses. So I'm thinking, hey, let me make some. Let's see how it's going to work out. But Gary says it'll kill the birds. Why? Well, I don't know. It's just too much cheese. But I don't know that for a fact. And neither does he. He thinks he's the know-it-all in the family. Are you, Gary? He's sitting right there. I'm giving him a hard time. He's putting a puzzle together. Okay. All right. Now, this is about all I'm going to put on this one, this cookie sheet. Come closer and you see what's going on. Okay, now I'm going to get a straw. Well, I dropped it, but I'm going to wash it off a little bit here. <laughs> And we're gonna keep on rolling. And I'm gonna punch a hole in it. Like so. Let's see how this is working. To give it like the cheesy look. Okay. And with that also it makes it puff up more too. Okay. Let's do that. Can y'all see what's happening? And guys, this will be a uh two-stepper. So we can come back with the finished product. And also, after these are golden brown, you're gonna preheat your oven 275 for 25 minutes. Now your oven may be a little bit different, so uh, just check it. But I'm gonna preheat mine, I've already got preheated on the second rack, 275 for 25 minutes, okay? Alrighty, and then after the finished product, we got one more step and I will show you what it is. Okay, guys, I'm gonna finish this. Don't bore you with it all. And I'll come back in just a few minutes, family and friends, with the finished product. See you soon. I am back with the amazing, amazing finished product. Guys, if you could just smell this over here, I want y'all to look. It's a little bit crispy, but I put, did put it for 25 minutes. And I did not turn them over, guys. I did not turn them over, okay? And I want y'all to see how crispy both sides are. Alrighty? And the last step I was going to tell y'all, uh, show you, is put salt. A little soft action. If you don't want to put any salt on here, you don't have to. Alright, guys? Just put a little soft action. You know, like cheese, it's are. They're kind of salty. But again, if you don't want salt on here, you don't have to worry about it. And I'm just going to put it on one on each side. I mean, one on a, one, so, okay, soft on one side instead of two. I'll get this out in a minute. And guys, that's it. They, you know what, I'm gonna leave them on here and let them cool down a little, a little more before I, before I put them in a bowl. But I will try one for you. Look at that. That's perfection. At least I think so. Or 
Believe me. I've ate cheese it after cheese it, day after day. Not one like this. You crunch. My word. Delicious. Another hit. Kills would love to do this. Of course, they can't put it in the oven. They could cut it up. Put them on the cookie sheet. Good for kids. Good for adults. Good for students. Uh, teens, preteens, anybody. Seniors like me. Oh, guys, I love it. Love it. I think my puppy dog wants one. One's not going to hurt my puppy. Warm enough. Come on, come here, boopy. There's my puppy, boopy. You want to try one? Let's see if I get a tail wag. Boopy. She's going tail wag. I did get a tail wag, Gary. That's it. Here we go. Perfect snack. Perfect. Um, I would not call this an unhealthy snack. It's just cheese, a little bit of salt. They're cool enough to put over here. I would not call this an unhealthy snack at all. So, yeah. And there you go. She's wanting more. No more booby. Anyway, guys, that's it um, for this uh, video. I love you all as always. And, guys, I haven't had a chance to say this. Thank you for everyone that tuned in for my one-year anniversary. And for the people that didn't get a chance to tune in, it was a Friday evening. You're busy. I understand that. I love you anyway. But uh, thank you all so much for, uh, for supporting me. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my video. Because I'm going to keep on keeping on as long as the Lord allows. God bless you. Godspeed. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.